Domo? Everybody's been wondering where you've been. Look at him daydreaming with his banana. Babies for shoesies. Thank you, Grandma. My oh, little sandals. Thank you, Papa. Look at Papa. Oh, I can't touch your toes. Oh, oh you can't eat them anymore. Good morning, guys. So Tim is out with Isaac, is taking him to see his great-grandparents. So it's just the dogs and I, and it's been a really, it's been a really nice morning. I give myself a facial. I had a chance to do some chores. Just chilling with the puppies, and I'm gonna be taking them out for a walk in a bit. A lot of you have been asking if I'm getting much sleep lately because apparently my dark circles are really bad. Um, I can't help it, yeah, I just haven't been sleeping too well. Just because I'm dealing with insomnia, it's that time of the year. I think especially because it's spring, my allergies are really up there. You ready puppies? Attention! My earring order came in, so I thought I'll show you guys. So this is the first one. I kind of like these earrings where it's kind of like long and it goes up the earlobe instead. Here is another one, really cute, just a gold coat hanger. Got little danglies on it. And then you guys know I love my underlobe earrings, so this one's got a star and then little hearts. And then another underlobe earring. This one's quite cute. Got butterflies and flowers. Really pretty for spring. Yay! Come here, Domo. Everybody's been wondering where you've been. Are you really gonna be eight months tomorrow? We're here in a German restaurant for lunch today. Getting my sausage. Tim got a, what is it? It's like a hearty German soup. Goulash. Goulash. And this is, I don't know. But it looks good. It's like salmon on some type of- Rice cake. Wheat bread maybe? Didn't take his eyes off when he wants. So this is um, chicken sausage. Happy guess first bite. Oh my goodness. Is it really good? <laughs> really good. How do people eat so many sausages though? I can barely eat one. I'm stuffed. And yeah, I can't stop eating. So stuffed, but that was so good guys. Mega meat overload. Speak properly. Mega sausage <laughs> overload. Oh yeah, honey. We forgot to get groceries. Next time we get grocery first. That yeah. never happens. Because <laughs> we're always hungry before we go out. <laughs> Food first. Good morning, everybody. I'm so hungry, so I'm just heating up the leftovers of yesterday's amazing lunch that we had. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I actually have this habit of eating lunch and breakfast just on my kitchen counter standing up. I don't know why, but it just feels really good. Why is it that leftover food always tastes better? This is kind of random and out of topic, but I've always wanted to carve a pumpkin. Maybe next year. Just gotta do it like this. This is why I am not quite the cook. For the first time in forever. funny is every time I open a knife, I always see in a comment that you guys are always like scared. <laughs> guys, come on. Love's an open door. Love's an open door. Quite looking forward to seeing Hubby and Isaac coming back. Little joys in life to see your family come home. That's too ironic. Luckily it was just a little, a little skim. Kids, concentrate when you cook. No singing. 
Just took off the plaster because waterproof my butt. <laughs> Why is it that little cuts hurt the most? Hi. Just have to say it. thank you to Auntie Minnie for your Jigglypuff onesie. It's so cute. Tim came home and he was like, why is he in a pink onesie? I'm like, it's Jigglypuff. Jiggly. Okay, all you need to do is give me a frying Isaac and we're almost there with your marker. Oh, actually, I think it's best to take this away from him. Come on. He's surprisingly strong. Just our luck because our neighbors next to us and our neighbors above us are all renovating. We have a very happy and well-rested baby right now. A little update for you guys because um, quite a few of you guys have been asking and I feel so honored. But um, regarding me going to Singapore, I will be flying on the 13th and coming back on the 16th. So I am going purely for work so I thought I'll have time to just, you know, explore. But um, they're talking. So fingers crossed, you know, by getting me there for YouTube Fan Fest as well. So I'll keep you guys updated if I can go then as well. Another thing to update you guys on our tank campaign we have made forty nine thousand dollars a hundred and wait we have a we have made forty nine wait how did I pronounce this we have forty nine thousand dollars no we have forty nine thousand and hundred and thirty three dollars we have made this amount we did it guys I just want to thank you all once again for support and I hope that when you wear the tank tops it will remind you that there will always be hope Right now, I'm just looking for a good charity to donate to for Nepal because as you guys know, the government is quite corrupted. So I just want to make sure that, you know, the money um, goes to good hands. Obviously, the most important thing right now is providing emergency relief so people get their food, their shelter, their water, and then also long-term relief so it helps to, you know, rebuild Nepal again. I've actually narrowed to um, a few already, but I'm still trying to decide which is the better one. The one that I looked into is Care. Um, I looked at MSF as well, and also for Global Giving, Save the Children, which is another one that I looked at. If you guys have any suggestions, then I would love to hear. Yeah.